just a little potato, done with practice. I am headed to my hair appointment with my hairdresser, Jan. I've gone to her for years. Um, as you can tell, my roots are like totally dark and grown out, so we're just gonna get that touched up. I like the color that it is now. Well, now it's like wet, so you can't really see. Uh, you've seen it in my other videos. Um, if you've been watching. So yeah, making my way downtown. Okay, a bit of an update. You know, I'm walking and the street is like narrow. And then down there, there was like some construction which made the street even narrower. And I was walking past this couple and this woman like literally like three feet in front of me coughs in that moment and doesn't cover her mouth. In this economy, girl, you should know better. So the last time I got, oh my God, I haven't washed my hair. My hair looks like a rat's nest. But the last time I got my hair done was um, the last time I was home, which was like about three months ago. And usually I don't have to get my hair touched up like all too often. Like sometimes I could even like wait a year. Last time I wanted more of a darker brown to like lighter brown to like the blonde highlights that I have. But that transition was a little too subtle and it just grew out into being just like my normal dark roots. So I'm just gonna go back to my normal blonde highlights and have it start, I guess like a half inch from the root so that it doesn't grow out as quickly. I'm just all about not having to pay so many visits to the salon, you know what I mean? ombre thing yeah it, it kind of just like made it grow out like pretty quickly yeah so I just want to go back to like the normal highlights okay. or maybe even like darker blonde up here but uh -huh. still like close-ish to the yeah, root so that it doesn't yeah. grow out as quickly Got it. Um, and then it, I, I like this color that I have now um, Me too. yeah into... it looks good in the pictures thanks all right so all what you we'll do is we'll do the same as before mm -hmm. um keep it closer to the root it looks like it grew out a little bit mm -hmm. more than <laughs> like sooner than usual mm -hmm. usually you go like six months yeah 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 all right so we'll i'll get it closer to the root if anything what i'll, I'll what i could do is when we tone it, mm -hmm. kind of make that a little bit darker when we tone it and still keep this bright so then when that washes out, then it's all kind of like growing out together. Okay. And so it's called like a shadow root and it just kind of, you know, gives you that immediate ombre look and then mm -hmm. once it fades out, then you're like, oh, I'm ombre again. Yeah. <laughs> so your roots won't start as far down as they are now. Uh -huh. So that way it'll last yeah. you a little bit longer. Yeah. But what the shadow root does is it kind of gives you like a nice blend. So mm -hmm. it gives you that immediate like, oh, it looks ombre. When you do the shadow, it kind of gives an illusion mm -hmm. of like an ombre without having a real ombre. And then are we going natural? Uh, yeah, I'll just put like some or like whatever product you yeah. have and I'll just let it air dry. Okay, cool. Really need to be careful with the kind of products that you're using. 
and if you're using lightener you want to make sure that you're using something that's got like a bond builder in it that'll protect the hair cuticle and also something that's um, low in volume so you don't want to go directly for like a 30 or 40 volume you want to start with like a 10 or 20. Today I used a clay lightener on you which is going to be like super moisturizing so that way we're not like messing with the integrity of your hair. Uh -huh. um, and then you always want to do like a conditioning treatment and sometimes too like even just working with the natural curl pattern so like let's say I wanted to you know take a piece and like lighten it by hand like I want to do it in the way that your hair is curling so like you see your hair is curling kind of like that like I'd want to paint in that direction so it's like I'm not disrupting anything uh, and I always process you naturally I never put you under heat because I also don't want to like over process your hair at all you know we're in it for the long haul like, we're processing <laughs> for you know as long as it takes for you yeah. to be a blonde so that's my advice on coloring curly hair <laughs> products at home and it's just like a super intense treatment that you can add to your products. After my hair appointment, I would scheduled to do a boxing class in Williamsburg with my brother um, at this studio called Overthrow. And uh, this is me walking through Williamsburg, a lot of aesthetic stores, a gallery. This one is a really nice and lush salon, a ceramics place, a jewelry place. 
And so we have the Overthrow Brooklyn. So I don't actually film my class because I still feel too awkward to do that. And here I am meeting my brother. We're dapping it up with our feet because of coronavirus. Photos. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was supposed to do um, a boxing class with my brother here, Treasure, but he was <laughs> he was late and he took the train going in the opposite direction, so he missed it. So now we're just gonna get cake. I mean, I did. I deserve this. <laughs> oh, this is called Martha's Bakery. Hi. Yeah, to go. Thanks. Um, this place has the best chocolate mousse cake. Wait, what do we normally get? This one? Yeah. I feel like it's layered normally. Okay, I, I feel. Nope. No, yeah it is. Hi, uh, can I have one uh, just chocolate mousse and one of the chocolate layer? Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was weird. <laughs> it was like we were both waiting for each other to say something else. <laughs> is it on autofocus? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Sure. Does it look like it is? I know. <laughs> uh, hi. Do you have any food at home? Yes. It wasn't but enough. <laughs> what, should I just eat that then? Should I just eat that then? Should I just have vegetables then? I thought we have dinner already. Can we go there? I'm still, I'm hungry still. <laughs> All right, I'll make you some uh, cow sausage, okay? Bye. Okay, I also got cake. <laughs> <laughs>